but I'm going to a new golf course on one I haven't fished yet. Um, it's kind of tucked away in some woods, so there are houses on one side of it, so maybe someone has stocked some bass in there or brought home a big catch and maybe I can, maybe I can catch it. So, um, we'll see. I have a little bit of a walk, not too bad, um, but I'm driving to the spot. I'm using my GoPro 4 still and I do not have sound. So, um, sorry about that in advance. I got my phone with me. There's actually a lot of deer right here, so. This guy is very interested in what I'm up to. Here's the pond that I already see. Some activity. So, let's get going. We got a pretty nice one right here. Really dark bass because it came out of blue dyed water. But let's get a weight on him. 2.93, almost a three pounder. Dang it. I was hoping I'd break a three on that one. But let's get it back. You guys can see the pond is dyed blue so all my baits were blue so I switched over to this uh, pink Cinco
Hey guys, welcome to day 10. It's early morning. I tied on a bunch of top water after the luck I had last night with some top water action. It's overcast right now, so I, uh, I think I am getting the bite. My time is limited. I don't know how much I'll use my phone. Once again, I'll be using the GoPro with no sound. So uh, let's get going and see if I can get on them with this top water. Okay guys, welcome to day 12, I think. I'm starting to lose track, but um, yesterday didn't go well. I did catch some fish, and I showed that to you guys, but it was a tough day, a storm came in. Um, but I'm trying something new, and that is flipping docks, and I really suck at it. Um, I'm trying to get better, but the pattern I was doing, which was slow rolling the uh, Texas rig on, rocks out in the uh, main parts of the lake I was catching fish but it wasn't catching giants i think the fish are back here now and i'm going to try to catch them so i re-rigged all my stuff pretty much tied on a lot and um hopefully one of them works i'm gonna be throwing a lot of stuff today so let's go
Hey guys, that was a cluster F of a catch there. Um, but uh, this is the biggest fish so far, which isn't saying much, but um, I'm keeping a five bass limit and I'll let you guys know what my best five are at the end of the day. This one's 110 right here. Hey guys, got an upgrade here, 113. Flipped it back behind this like wrestling mat right here. And uh, wasn't really paying attention and he took it and it felt huge at first. But then once I saw it, I was like, oh, it's not that big, but still an upgrade for my five, five bass limit.
Hey guys, welcome to day 13. I want to give you a quick rundown of what happened yesterday. I did something different than what I like doing, and that's, you know, fishing around docks and whatnot. I decided to keep a five bass limit because I never really do that, and I thought I'd give it a try. I ended up catching seven pounds, five ounces for a five bass limit. That's not very much, but at least I had uh, technically a tournament bag. So bass length limits on this lake is 14 inches. So um, that's why I was checking those measurements and weighing them in and trying to figure out what my best five was. So yesterday the boat was running on gas fumes. Um, that's why I didn't drive around very much. Last night I ran to a gas station and bought some really expensive two-stroke oil motor but luckily they had some and filled up both gas cans so I got 12 gallons of gas today so I'm gonna do something unusual for me um, the boats running great so I'm not afraid that it's gonna die on me because it is an old boat but it got tuned up before I came here and it's running great and I haven't had any issues with it so I'm gonna take it on kind of a long run and I'm gonna get out of this creek channel that is very busy this weekend and uh, getting really heavily fished. So I'm gonna get out of here. I'm gonna run up the lake a little bit. I'm gonna run to an area that has a lot of rocky banks and a little bit less docks, but there are some docks to flip. So um, that's gonna be the pattern for today. This whole trip has been a huge quest to try to break my PV. I came close once. Um, think to find that PV I'm gonna have to find it out on the lake so hopefully this run is worth it I've never fished there before and hopefully it pans out so uh, let's not waste any more time let's go get out on the water